Yes, YouTube. So obviously I haven't posted on here in a while and today's video is going to be different to all the types of videos I've done before. As you'll have seen by the title, I'm trying to visit as many football grounds as I can within one day. The only rules are the ground has to be in the current 92 of the Football League and I have to take a photo outside every ground. I've also got a checklist that I'll be completing across the grounds I manage to get to. It doesn't matter what order I do it in, I've just got to tick them all off by the end of the day. I have a rough idea of the route I'm going to take. I'm not sure 100% yet. I think London is the best place to go just because there's the most clubs in the closest proximity. So I'm going to drive, I'm going to tube some. We're going to see what happens. I have no idea how many I'm going to get done, but there's only one way to find out. Okay, so I've decided for my first stop, I'm going to go to Sutton. Just looking at it on the map, I think that's the most logical place. Obviously, newly members of the EFL, which means they're in the top 92, so they fit that. And they're a League 2 team, so they'll tick off my League 2 ground. But first things first, I need to fill up with some petrol. Right, first ground, Sutton United. League two, ticked off, bash. I think this is gonna be a bit harder than I thought. Just at Sutton then, I was trying to record, I wanted to get a photo by the sign for the stadium or anything. And then this guy comes up, he's like, what are you doing here? So I was just, oh, I'm filming. Um, he said, you need to speak to the people in the office here for an hour. So I just took a photo and then I left. So um, apologies, the footage for that one wasn't great. Hoping it's easier at the bigger grounds, but next stop, I'm going to go to Wimbledon. Right, ground number two, I am at Wimbledon. Let me flip the camera. Let's get out. things was to get a selfie with the statue. There we go. There's another one ticked off. Batch. Okay, so that's Wimbledon ticked off and the statue, which is really good to get done. So I wasn't sure when I was going to be able to do that. Next stop is Brentford. So I think this one's a little bit of a drive, but let's go. Brentford, Prem Stadium, ticked off. Have a look at that. Yeah, decent. What a ground, actually. New one, obviously. Built not that long ago. Looks amazing, to be fair. Looks really nice. So, another one done. I am absolutely dying for a piss here. I need to go quickly, because I haven't been or eaten all day since I left. So, I think we're like two and a half hours in, which isn't too bad. Ticked off three. Next stop is Fulham. <laughs> arrived at Fulham I'm down the side of the stadium I was I got lucky with parking I didn't really think about parking that much but I'm sort of just whacking it somewhere putting my hazards on and trying to be quick but let's show you the ground That's Craven Cottage done. Ground number four ticked off. Next, I'm gonna to go to Chelsea because I'm pretty sure that's literally right around the corner. So a couple of minutes and then Chelsea. Chelsea is proving to be an absolute nightmare. Couldn't find anywhere to park. Definitely should have got the uh, tube from Fulham. Um, I've parked somewhere, I'm probably gonna get a ticket. And I've it, it's pissing it down. I've got to walk a little bit to get to the ground and there's loads of security around so I'm not even sure I'll be able to um, get close but we'll have a look, we'll try, let's see. Hi Chelsea, um, I had to get bag searched 
to get through this one just to look around the stadium which I'm uh, massive obviously never been in it's a ground I need to tick off I might have a look in the mega store and see if this can be the one where I tick off getting something from the club shop badge is too big and too high for me unfortunately this one I've just done Chelsea, number five ticked off, bit of a walk and I've had a massive stroke of luck because I parked there for a fair bit so I got food too and as I was walking down the road that I've parked on, the traffic warden, the ones that gives out tickets was down that road and I was like, no, nah, I'm done for. But unless it's cameraed, I've come back to the car and we haven't got a ticket. So I'm gonna eat now what I picked up and then we're off to QPR. <laughs> Just at QPR, had a bit of a stinker, um, difficult to get to. Well, it's not really, I just didn't know where to park, so a bit of a walk away, probably really windy, you probably can't even hear what I'm saying now. Um, but yeah, back to the car and then off to Arsenal. So somewhere like this, it's mental what a stadium. Don't think that's gonna happen. Just done Arsenal, enjoyed that one. So I'm going to Tottenham next. That was number seven, Tottenham will be eight. Half an hour or the sat nerve saying to Tottenham. I had no idea it was gonna be that long, but let's crack on. We have protesters. That's Tottenham done, as you can see. I parked right outside the stadium. I had to be quick because I can't park here for long. And you couldn't even go up the stairs, so I couldn't get much there at all. Um, that's number eight. I think it's Leighton Orient next. Round number nine, another League Two is haven't ticked anything off here. Done, let's go. That's Leighton Orient, done, number nine. Now on to West Ham, only 10 minutes away. Bash. <laughs> Day is getting long, as you can see it's starting to get dark now, this is number 10 I think. I've been going for about 8 hours, um, easiest to park at so far, there's so much space around it and obviously an unbelievable stadium. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, so I did just do Charlton and I recorded a video of me outside the ground, but for some reason it didn't record, didn't save, whatever. So that's Charlton done, League One ground ticked off. So all I've got left to do is to get something from gift shop, which I think is going to be hard now because I think they're going to be shut, and to and to touch the badge. That's the other one. So I'm now at Millwall. Um, never been here before. It's late. Been out for about eight and a half hours now. Um, but yeah, let's show you Millwall. So I'm at Millwall. As you can see, this is ground number 12, I believe. So really good going so far. Taking a bit longer than I thought to get between grounds, but one I haven't been to before. The gift shop isn't open, unfortunately, but yeah. East London at the moment, it's evening time, five something, here's Millwall. Bash. I was planning on trying to do Crystal Palace as well next. But it's game day there today, which I didn't think about. And it'll take me 40 minutes to get there. So by the time I'm there, I won't be able to park and it'll be too busy around the ground. So I'm going to make one last stop at the Mighty Red Inn, which is an hour and 40 minutes away. And that'll be me done. And that'll be 13 grounds. So let's go to Red Inn. <laughs> Saved the best stadium until last. Reading FC. Ah, the ding. Um, obviously, been here a fair few times. I wanted to end here anyway. Closest one to home. Wrap it up. I've managed 13 grounds. I'm pretty impressed with that. I left home this morning at 9 o'clock. And I'll put the time on the screen now. But by the time I get home, it'll have been about 11 hours. Um, so I think it's a fairly good effort. And I would appreciate, bearing that in mind, if you've watched up to this point, if you could like the video, if you could subscribe, follow on TikTok, all that good stuff, because it has taken a while and a fair bit of money as well. But I enjoy doing these things. I'm going to make loads more YouTube videos. So let me know in the comments what you'd like to see, and I'll keep them coming. But thanks for watching. Last thing I forgot on the checklist for today was to touch a badge. I've saved it to the end, to the best ground, the best club. Here we go. Day done. Bush.